I, I just wanted to ask what you would say to other um, people who've had a stroke about the benefits of, of what this has meant to you. So this um, workshop we've been going for, I have gained a lot from it. Why? Because you are able to express yourself. And the people teaching us are very kind. They can mix well with other people. They understand our needs. And when you make a mistake, they won't brush you off. We will laugh about it. We talk about it. And then it encourages you to come back the following day. We eat a lot. <laughs> 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 What I just want to say about this is I want everybody, if they can mix, go out, not to be indoor. If they don't know where to go, they can ask people, the social care or their friends, that maybe they know where they are doing voluntary meetings for stroke. Because it's better to be in the midst of people who have stroke. You will know the improvement or the one that is worse than yours, that there is hope for you in everything. It's not the exercise alone to communicate with others. Then the sharing views, talking together, and then I wanted to thank all the organizers for this program. I wish I would be there next year too to continue with them because it's a lovely thing. It makes us know more people and interact with people and enjoy ourselves and make the life so simple that before, after stroke, you still have life. Mm -hmm. When you are still alive, many things for you to do in this world. Mm -hmm. Before I can't go out, I, I will be in the, but now I go to parties, I go to, <laughs> I go to dinner, lunch, everything now, I'm enjoying my life <laughs> because I believe that when I'm still alive, I have many things to do. I drank wine, everything, like yesterday, I enjoy. That is what we call life. So it's not that because you have stroke, you should be thinking that you are no more. I, you, some friends may leave you, you will get new people and, and mix it and enjoy. But to, not to be alone in the house, be thinking. Because the more you stay indoor, another stroke is coming. Because you will develop blood pressure again, high one, from there, crisis may come up. So, and you don't need it. You need to move on. That's it. I'm taking it. I'd like to chat a little bit more about the process, perhaps some of you went through in, in order to kind of reach that point. It was, it was really lovely and the interaction, although, and although there were very individual bits, the interaction was really nice as well, and how you, you worked together. So I'd just like to know a little bit how you came to that point. And I think it's fair to say that <clears throat> we all, we, none of us had a very, very clear idea about how we were going to feel our way forward. But we embraced each other and came to know each other and came to trust slowly through simple exercises like the one that we started with today, the, the mirroring, which of course is a wonderful way into picking up and being sensitive to what another person is offering you and taking it and using it. And we moved our way forward through exercise and sound, through into beginning uh, for people to share little bits of their experience, little fragments. And we started to work on these fragments and finding ways of framing the fragments so that maybe they could read to somebody who wasn't in our process. And that's why it's so exciting for us to have you here today to feed back to us about how much that did read to you. So far it sounds like it did.